Hello, in this video we're going to use a perfect complement's utility function to calculate the income elasticity of demand. So here's a perfect complement's utility function where utility is the minimum of x or y. We want to solve for the income elasticity of demand for good x. So this consumer, when maximizing utility, will use equal amounts of good x and good y. So just going to set what is in parentheses here equal to one another, so x equals y. Once I do that, I'm going to plug it into the consumer's budget constraint, where the budget constraint takes this form. Income equals the price of good x times units of good x plus the price of good y times units of good y. Where I have a y here, I'm going to substitute an x. After all, x equals y, so I can make that substitution. So after that substitution, okay, y equals x, we have this. I'm going to factor out an x term on the right-hand side. So factoring out an x term. And then dividing through by what's in parentheses. That will give us the demand for good x. So this is the demand for good x. So now we're going to calculate the income elasticity which is going to be given by this formula. We're going to first take the partial derivative of the demand function for good x. So down here we're going to take the derivative of this with respect to m. And then we're going to multiply it by m, income, divided by x, the demand for good x. So moving down one step then, the partial derivative of the demand function with respect to income is going to just be 1 over the price of good x plus the price of good y. So that's the first thing. Uh, the next thing I'm going to do, I have an m here. I'm just going to rewrite the m, put it right here. And then the next step for x, I'm going to plug in the demand for good x, which is income divided by the price of good x plus the price of good y. So for good x, I substituted the expression for the demand for good x. And what happens here is things nicely cancel. The, the price terms here are going to cancel. Uh, the income terms, m terms, will cancel. And we have an income elasticity equal to 1. Okay, I hope you found this video helpful.